another day here. So again, the same story. Clean it up from the bushes, from all those trees. So then, it was already late. Right. I got my toolbox, got some tools, I prepared some timber. So the plan is to make a ladder to claim to the bee trap and look what is inside the bee trap. Abandoned bee trap. Let's go.
of that being a beehive. As there is two entrances, in the bottom, on the top, and it's made from the plywood. Let's open the lid. Some carbon. Yep, that we that was a a beehive, and someone did forget about it. And it's already eaten by the mouse. A wax mold. There's some leaves inside. Yep, it looks like a long time ago here was a beach. And it looks <coughs> as that beehive also was home for wasps. Here's a wasp net. There's some eggs eaten by the mouse. There is a two holes. The mouses they build their own entrance. All sorts of rubbish. There's also walnuts. paper, wasp paper, yep, that was a wasp net, As you see, during the years, all the wax has been consumed by the wax mall, by the mice, what's that, it looks like a pollen. Well, that's it, some leaves, 
walnuts. Our wax is absolutely dried out. It's like a powder. Little's was made from the proper beekeeper. That looks a professional stuff. All right then. At least we pleasure our curiosity. I saw first time that bee trap beehive. The first time when we came here so today we decide to climb to the tree and take down that beehive well then the bees was here definitely that means the bees like the place So we're gonna put them back in the box. <coughs> Quite nice frames. I like them. Proper wiring. frame a beehive. A perfect for the summer. To collect a poly uh, particular nectar. Probably that beehive was placed here in early spring. In early spring when all the willow trees start to bloom you know the white little kittens they producing a nectar and a pollen and this is the most valuable honey on the planet well then welcome to the blue bee blacksmith <laughs> 